What am I writing? Just my, try to record something. 12. 12 campaign. We have agent here. Let me just put next to. Mm -hmm. We have trade kings. Total. Okay. California. Okay, I'll just write CBA so that we don't waste a lot of time set technique. Then you have real meat, which is uh, real meat butcheries, RMB. You have spectra, uh, clear, SC. And you have wood reliance technology. Mm -hmm. Okay. This side, you have Luquesa. So that I type faster, just give me the names Luquesa Chama. Luquesa Chansa. Okay, chance to answer. Mm -hmm. Mansa. Mm -hmm. Chess for Chanda. Mansam Tare. Is it? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Then you have. Again, Mansam Tare. Right? Is it what I'm saying? Yes, Californian beverage is also done by. Yeah. Then you have uh, Cheswa Chanda. Then you have uh, Cheswa Chanda again. Then Cheswa Chanda like this. There are only two names, right? There are three names. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So from here, yes. what are you told? Mm -hmm. da, 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 da. Uh, using data validation and the indirect function, the model should allow the user to direct the agent from a drop down. Mm -hmm. So here, what? Okay, the model should the 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 user. The, the model should allow the user select the agent from a drop down. So what what we want to see is that if you have an agent here, if you pick say for example you pick total, this side we should be able to see the okay this is a campaign. This side, we should be able to check on the agent, whether it is Luquesa. So if we pick total, we should only be able, we should only be able to see who, to see, to see, if, if we pick total, we should only be able to see Mansam Tare. So this is how you would actually break three. You would show under uh, campaigns, we pick them like this. Copy, transpose. Mm -hmm. So under Trade Kings, you have how many names? You have one? Mm -mm, Sam. Hmm? It should, be the... it should be the other way around. Under Luquesa Chansa, we should only have Trade Kings and uh, Spectra Clear. It should be like the names should the name should have uh, the one agent is representing two companies. Okay, okay, just wait. It's saying using data validation and the indirect function, the model should allow the user to select the agent. Oh, okay. It's the agent. You pick the agent, then it shows it should show the companies, isn't it? Yes, sir. Yes. So 
how many agents we have these agents and just do this Mm -hmm. So under under Luquesa we have um, under Luquesa you have uh, trade kings, just just trade kings, right? Isn't it? And uh, you have these two. Yes. Then under under Luquesa chance. Yeah, and I'm the chance as trade kings and spectra clear. Once I'm Tale Toto and Californian beaver. Mm -hmm. Chase what chance are real meets and reliance. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right. So these are the ones that eh, you you have here. So we have so this side we should do change that. We should have the agent and the and the company. Mm -hmm. So in short, in terms of the agents, we have, let me do this. Mm -hmm. Agent, which in this case, mm -hmm. What did I call them? I call them agent. Mm -hmm. Are you there? We are here, sir. Uh -huh. So what, what it is, if we pick, this is how we should visualize it. If we pick Luquesa like this, we should be able to only see trade kings, isn't it? This side. Trade kings and spectra clear. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay. So then this is what we are going to do. We'll name this. We'll name this by the by the names, by their names, by the the agent names. So like here, this is going to be called request. Mm -hmm. So out MD. This will be called look where look where look where such answer. But I need to put it. Eh? I'll do it like this. Because it doesn't allow space, huh? So I'll do like this. I'll say, Luquesa, chance. Mm -hmm. I'll press OK. OK. I'll come this side. Are you there? Mm -hmm. I'll come this side. Yeah. I'll highlight that. I'll highlight that. Then again here, I'll do out MMD. So we'll pick Mansa. Italy. Then here, out MMD, I'll pick Chess One Dash Chanda. Mm -hmm. It was too far, and if, if you wanted, you could pick the first names, then we can, I'll show you, I think, method two, which will be slightly easier than <coughs> this my fence, that my underscores that I'm putting. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should call this method one, but uh, nine hours after.
put the bus, then bus we can communicate the vehicle, sorry. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have named this. So what we, we can then now do, we'll do this, we'll say, we want the drop down here, right? So how do we get this drop down? So that whatever we pick this side, the other side we are able to also see the the. the mm -hmm. So the whole issue would be this on data validation. Sorry. Out A, B, V. So it go here on the list. So on the list, we'll say, equals. if we do like this, first before we do that, I will come up with a formula here. I will say, equals, we want to find the indirect, uh, indirect text. But then we are going to bring in an if. If 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 we had just one 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 name without the space here, would would actually make it a, a less complicated. Because then what we want to do, we want to say, if this name here, if this name here, it is going to give us a ref thing, which is fine. But this is what we, we want to, to, to do so that when we bring in the drop down, it will, will still be able to pick these, 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 these companies here. But there must be a formula that we should actually take in the in the in the data validation. So let me first show you. If we are to do so that it's more simpler, then you 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 will see what we are going to do on this. If we are saying we are looking at province. Let me just do this. I say we are who? Southern province. CP. Then we have Northwestern. Here you have Livingston. Toma, Alom, here you can have one dollar, Kitwe, Bola, Sak, I can have Solace, and Minelong. So this will be our demand SP our demand demand twisted. Mm -hmm. So if you're looking at the town. Mm -hmm. For example, mm, if you're looking at it, okay, so I'll do this. Are you even there? Hello? We are here, sir. Okay. Okay. Just trying to. Mm I name this. Just 
just say sorry, so so sorry. Supposed to then I'll pick this cut going to data validation. So this is basically what we want to see, guys, isn't it? Well, we are saying if we pick CB, we should be able to see Ndola Kitwe. I don't know how Lusaka, where did I even put Lusaka here? Sorry. Mm -hmm. We should be able to see this. Uh, Chinzi, are you there? If we go to, that's a concept. I'm sure this is what you want to see. If you go to Northwestern, all you want to see here is, so always in wrong, right? Yes. Concept. If we say we go to we go to we go to SP Southern Province, we should be able to only see Livingston Choma Kalomo. Isn't it the concept? There, what what we want to see. If we pick request such answer, we should only be able to see those particular towns that you want to see the companies uh -huh, the companies that you want to see so here the the the, the let me just paint this here the problem is that we have some spaces on these names you get me yes uh -huh. so there are there are two there are quite a number of methods that we can use because in naming, naming this, uh, uh, what we, we cannot leave space. It doesn't allow us to leave space. So we'll have to push in car, a hyphen in between there. Yeah. So meaning that if you are here, if you are here, I can do this. This is just basically the formula that I would actually do. I can say, Equals, just check what I'm going to do here. Mm -hmm. I, would, I, would, I want to come up with a formula which will, which will push in a car, a car, a car underscore, sorry, not a half, an, an underscore in between. That is, right. that is the formula that you just need to master from here. So we can actually use, we can actually use this. Let me, I don't want to come up with a very complicated formula. So if we say equals, fine, this is what we're using last time. Just please master this before I go back find so what we want to find in this name we want to find the space so inverted <laughs> comma space inverted comma within which text within this text starting from where starting from one mm -hmm. so it gives us that the space in between this is actually only number eight so here then now, what I'm, what I'm going to do, I'll do like this, I'll say, if I wanted to break this, to have, the, the, to, to have this name, similar to what I've named it there, I'll say equals, just observe. Uh, left. So which, num which text am I picking? I'm picking this text, or I'm picking this text number of characters number of characters would be this eight minus one which gives me request mm -hmm. so the whole issue here i want i'm going to combine these formulas because then it gives me request of which i can still say and then 
inverted comma, don't just get confused. Inverted comma will come up with another method. And then I'll pick right. I can pick mid. So just watch, you know this, I'll come up with an easier one because you're going to the exam. So the text that I want to pick, this is the text. I'll start from number eight and I can have 100 there. So minus one, plus one, so I can have this. So now, if I do this, I say, I say, well, in here, let me just go in there. I go to, to data validation. I go to list. I come here under source. So the source there, I say, equals indirect. And I pick this. Press OK. So I have trade kings because I've picked requester here. So if I go to Mwansa, I come this side, I'll have Toto and CB. But I don't want you to do this in the exam. I don't want you to get confused. If I come to Chesa, I come this side, I'll have RMB, SC, and RT. Myra, move there. So now, <laughs> just wanted to show you that this is a, one of the methods. If, if, if it were me, I, would, I can still create this thing easily. But I have to respect uh, I have to respect your thing, your, 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 your time and how you should do it in the exam. So this is the first method. So let's just ignore it. Here, instead of putting that car and, and uh, hyphen, this thing that we're putting, let's just change so that we have the first names, huh? Chizu. Yes, coach, I'm, I'm with Mara. So, so, so let's, let's now change this. I just wanted to show you that we can do that, but let's change that. Let me just break the, the names that I've put in here so that we restart. So the names are where? Names are here. Mm -hmm. okay. So I've removed the names. So here, what we are going to do, we'll name this. We'll just name it as requester. No, sorry. Mm -hmm. Press enter. The first one. This one we are going to name it as Mansa. Then this one we are actually going to name it as Cheswa. Mm -hmm. And then mind. So now that we have named these as first names, so this is what we are actually going to do. We'll come this side. Just check what we're going to do. We'll go to data validation. Any list, we pick the list here. Mm -hmm. So it's a equals indirect, because it's an indirect formula then we want to actually pick the first one. So we will first need to find where the space is. So say mid, open bracket, just copy this. The first one that we start with, we start with the text in here. Mm -hmm. But then from here, that is the text we want to find. We want to start from 
number what? So we want to start from number one. This is how the mid formula, let me just do it from here first, equals mid. This is how you should do it. You open that. So the text you're actually saying, you're picking from here. Start number, you're starting from number one. Are we there? Number of characters. Number of characters, you go in here, you say find. You can decide. You open the find text. What do you want to find? You want to find space. Within which text? Within which text? Within this text. Start number, you have to start from number one. Hello? We are here, sir. Uh -huh. So you have to start from number one. So all you are trying to do, you want to find that space. So this space is the one that demarcates surnames from your first name. So we know for sure that now the number of characters that you need are only for the first name are only, are only six, meaning that it's this number seven here minus one for this one. So this is the thing that you, you have first. Mm -hmm. So we have one, Cheswa there. If I go back, there's some space. So I'll do, I'll do this minus one so that I close this. Now I'll pick this formula. Check. I'll pick this formula as is up to there. Copy. You just do control C, escape. Then I'll come in this form in this thing. Go now to data validation, and value, go to list. So in the source, I'll type equals indirect, open bracket, control V. I'll paste that formula in there because it worked. Then I'll press, okay. I'll even remove this part here. That's all. So under chess one, you can see chess one, there are how many? There are three. There's the RMB, I don't know what it is, SC and RT. So if I come this side, I change from chess one to Luquesa. It should be able to give me trade kings just. If I change from here to, to Mansam Tale, so on Mansam Tale, I should be able to only see Toto and CB. Hello? Hello, sir. So what I want you to do, that same question, try, to, don't, don't fear to make a mistake. The only time you should fear to make a mistake it is in the exam. As I bat, I'll give you about five or so minutes. Try to work it out. All right, so we use, the mid. Yeah? we use mid. We use mid. You use mid, yeah. If you master the mid one. Mm, not really. OK, again, method two. Let me check method two. Method two could be this. Since we are still on video, Let, I hope it works. It could be this. It could be where we say, where we say, uh, equals, if we say, uh, if we say, if we say, if we pick the name like, Mm. If you pick a name like, okay, I'm just coming here. Hope it works. List. I go like this. Indirect. Mm -hmm. Mm 
Hmm. Indirect. Then do this. I say. Uh, that I hope it does. I pick this and do that and do that. Can this work? Sorry, then I come here. Let's try where I have to pick the. No, this one it can't. Mm -hmm. Come here. Is the meat so complicated for you guys? Coach, hmm? yeah. um, what about um, using the underscore the name of the agents? Because remember, those ones that you told us that what you the name that you give the agents should be the same name that you should go and use. I don't know if you get my point. Yes, yes, but now on the underscore, on the underscore, the the, the what, what if. What if we give the agents those names with underscores, like Luquesa yes. underscore chance? Yes, you can do this. First, do this. You can still do this. You can do this. If you think that that is that is faster for you, you can do this. This one doesn't change this. Mm -hmm. So if you think this is faster for you, you can do that, right? So you have all this, okay? Then here, we change these names, you edit. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And give them names. So, uh -huh. Depend, it, it, all, it basically depends on what your preference. If you, if you, if you, hate, if you hate me so much, you can do this. No, I am you every time, coach. Uh -huh. So you can do this. You see where you have your trade kings there. You have your your trade kings, meaning that here on define name, you are actually going to call it Luquesa dash chance. Mm -hmm. Then here you are going to have our diamond. Mansa, I found that. Mm -hmm. Then here, they are actually going to have them. Oh, they are going to have them. Just one. Chanda. Mm -hmm. So once you have this, then now you can come here. Out A, B, B. Clear all, then start again, which is indirect. There should be an equal sign. Don't forget to put the equal sign. Mm -hmm. Then you come here, you do the same thing and close it there. Did I remove the thing? Did I remove the data validation? Mm -hmm. Clear. Okay, so we start here because we know that now we have this, we have all that. Then here, this is where these names also change. Which names do we pick? Uh -huh. So, meaning that what you're going to have there, like on Quesa, it will be, oh, okay, it's, it's, it's fine. 
So from here, we'll change, we'll change the names. I don't know which one it picked. Let me come to data validation, which is urgent here. Okay. Mm -hmm. So meaning that here you have this copy of Mtale there. Copy Requesa here. Copy Cheswa there. Mm -hmm. So you have Requesa this side. Then now you come to data validation. Because indirect, you pick that, close, and do this. Mm -hmm. So for request side to be that, if you go to Mutare, under Mutare, you have those two. If you go to Cheswa, Cheswa, you have that. You have this. But the tricky is on data validation. Here, you have seen the way it has locked everything. You make sure that mm -hmm. it does not lock the row so that once you take the formula down, it goes down. Mm -hmm. So I don't know which method would be better for you. No, this same one is first, but just to make sure that it doesn't lock. It doesn't, yeah, you don't you don't lock. Let me just back lock. quickly. Mm -hmm. my, my driver is coming. We'll continue communicating no. in, in the car. Up to the up to eleven, maybe eleven twenty. Hi. No. Okay. Okay. I'll let you know. Or you call me, not me. Start calling you. Okay. Uh -huh.